Hey buddy, let's get this let's play going boys. I am Max Tech 2 4 and you are watching part two of Scott Pilgrim vs. the World the Game. And as I promised, I showed you Steven Stills' stats off and as you can see they are maxed out. So let's get on with stage three. <laughs> We have all four gays standing in a row. And yes, I'm counting Steven Stills. You'll see in a minute. Well, not a minute. You'll see why. And I show off the band's names. We got MV Adams, Todd Ingram, and Lynette. I, if I read it correctly. Yeah, Lynette. And you're all the classic demon head. Okay, profile of Steven Steels. Steven Steels is the leader of the band Sex Pop Bomb. His bass guitarist is Scott Pilgrim, no duh. And Kim Pines is the drummer. They only know, know how to use three chords, so they're not that good. Dark World! Easy to get out of, all you have to do is match all four buttons at different times. Or you could just match one and go. Really? Two in a row? Okay, the, all you have to do is beat the bouncer. Hey! All you have to do is beat the I Hey! Beat the bouncers and destroy all all the opponents to go on to the next room. And apparently I missed one. And showing off that combo again. Okay, two out of the three girls that are standing right behind Steven is Kim, Kim's roommate. The other one that I'm trying to punch right now is the one who turns Steven Stills gay. And of course, Kali knives it once again. And just so you know, whenever you're playing a game like this, Money is always the best option. If you do not have money, you're in big trouble. Especially if you need to heal up. And this is where the game starts getting a little bit complicated, so watch out. It's best to ha have a, a good certain amount of stats out at this point. Trick, beat all the bouncers, all the enemies run off like little cowards. That's because they sissy. Only not again. Especially in that crowd, it's really hey. Now, what's that? Steven steals a cup and. Scott Pilgrim were actually high school schoolmates. Same thing with Wallace Wells. They all met in college. Except Scott ended up being, being uh, roommates with Wallace Wells, who is his cool gay roommate. One thing I hate is trying to smack people with an item and have the uh, have a different item smack you uh, on the rebound. Of course, th I had enough with this, so I kept calling knives whenever I darn whatever I needed her. And 
introducing NB Adams. Oh, come on. What? You seriously had to do it in the bathroom? <laughs> and yes, Todd Ingram was cheating on Envy with the mat. Go figure. We're going to get rid of this move right off the bat. And on to the, to the mid boss. Where you fight Lynette in her bionic arm, the drummer of Clash at Demon Head, Todd, Todd Ingram's the bass player, and Envy Adam is actually a think, keyboardist and lead singer. Normally I beat Lynette to a pulp, but apparently this time I got Envy. Normally it drags out longer than that. Looks like you're going to need another bionic arm, Lynette. Now, we may be in the backstage maze, but it's not actually a maze. Of course, I have to point out the Scott Pilgrim the movie poster of Envy Adams, where she was a blonde instead of a brunette. And I barely showed off to uh, the reason why you need to keep running to the right, which is Todd's chasing you. Very battle. Fight! Now, if you just stay there and do not press the button when shown, you'll go on forever. So, come here, come here. And let's take it outside. Uh, if I feed my pants right now, would you believe? Uh, crap! I messed up the line. If I feed my pants, can you blame it on rain? It's not raining. Even though, uh, in the book, it was actually raining when you said that line. Of course, it normally, it's normally longer if you don't have max stats, but... The vegan police did their job. And, uh... Of course, I run off to show you the one-up, but I end up not getting all the money like I was hoping for, because Steven got stuck way too much. But, undefeated, undefeated, un... I have no... That's the first time I've ever seen that stat. And Warpipe, take me away! I've always questioned this cutscene, too. By the way, all cutscenes are unskippable. I find that cutscene romantic, but weird altogether. Oh, who's that in the background? Why, well, it's none other, none other than... Mr. Child, Nice Child's dad. In the next... Which I kind of find this part fitting, because he ties into the next level. Because of the level. Book-wise, not movie-wise. Mr. Chow was never in the movie. But Mrs. Chow was. Not in time to mom. But in the fourth book, Mr. Chow was chasing Scott all throughout the book. This background cutscene is spread. This background cutscene is a homage to the, the original trilogy of Ninja Gaiden. Come on, Mr. Child. And of course, he is almost 
down. Okay, dead now. Now it says, Mr. Chow unlocked, but if you saw my first episode, he's just a sub character. I have to go change characters, so I'll let the let the transition do it for me. If there ever was a transition. Next up, the Mona Flowers. Got Pilgrim's girlfriend, recent girlfriend, cheating cheating on knives with her. American knows about the subspace doors, and. At a sexy phase. Sexy phase. And for level about ninjas, they are sure a bunch of roller skating, rollerblading girls. And bandits. Boy, do I hate the bandits. They hit you, you lose money. You hit, hit them. Well, you get money if you kill them, but. You'll lose more money than you will gain. We'll make sure I make quick work of them. No, if you lose your money, you're able to get it back, which I do show off. But now, if, as soon as that guy dies. Of Knives' mom again, and her high school and Knives' high school friend. Not much known about her friend, but Boy, do I hate bandits. Luckily, I do quick work of them here. Baseball? Okay, getting my money. Oh no! Yep. You can fall off the train, and that's just. But just uh, proven there. I hope my mic doesn't do that. In case you didn't hear, there was a, a siren going off in the background. Another sleeping dog pile. Ninja! Finally, we get into some ninja-ish enemies. I say ninja-ish because they can go down to one hit and on what you have. Let's do the moonwalk, <laughs> Ramona. <laughs> F you, Rocky! F you! And now we're at the Frying Tengu. <laughs> then we get introduced to more ninjas that end up shooting fireballs instead of coming at you with their sword. They will still attack you with the sword if you're not careful. Oh look, Trace. Trace is online. And in the background, it's got Pilgrim's parents. Unlike Nairman from Brain Scratch Comms, forgetting who the heck they are. It's 
got Pilgrim has a mom and dad, unlike most uh, RPG games do. It's not only their grandparent or the guardian. But we get we get introduced to the heavy enemies, and yes, I'm going to be using this the sword through most of the level. It's really hard to take those guys down with, with your fist. I like to drag them into going into the fryer. The fryer. And I sit here and let <laughs> and let the fire put them down a little bit. So that ninja gets smart. And now we're introduced to the once in a lifetime enemies. The ones that catch on fire. Easy only has one HP, but they're paying the butt to take down. So what I like to do let them be idiots and run themselves into the, the fryer. Like that. And that. And that. And like I said, mo money is is the best thing you can have. It'll help you, keep, you can buy food items, you can buy some other stuff too, which I'm not gonna show. Which that's the next part. That's mainly food and health items and lives. Yeah, I've never lost to this thing, so I don't know what happened. I tried picking up the, uh, dog mallet, but I couldn't do it. And there was no money in there either. First, this is what. First, then I started having trouble fighting. A little, a little bit. I don't exactly remember where. I think it's. No, wait. That's the next video. What am I thinking? Now you need to watch out because when you're flashing, you do that. Watch out for the holes, and you'll be safe. Unless you do that that twice. Or three times. In fact, I had enough. I ended up going to get any food. Hey, look, there's Knives his friend again. Of course, max, max out on health, and I'm out. I'm out of here! Being impatient, I am taking the shortcut Cause around. You'll still end up go going to the same place. It'll just be one screen ahead. Come on, Ramona. We haven't got all day. At least the Bell does really good work with that, with the blocks. Only problem with having max status characters you can't not control them easily when they're running. And let's go. Let's see, I go back to show you where you would spawn if you took the regular route. Isn't it? In fact, I thought I lost my first test file. Because I couldn't use it, and I decided to do do this with Kim. The only problem is, when we're facing the boss, I ended up owning her before. Uh, I ended up owning the boss before she could even uh, use her substitution, substitution or shadow clone. Yes, I would have. So far, I've only been able to go 
up to 162 combo. And the reason why I can't go is because of that guy. But now he's dead. No threat damage or a pain in the butt, but as long as you're not in your there, as long as you're not in their line of fire, you're all right. And they have a little chain reaction going on there. If you take any items, you'll grow and lose it instantly when you go through the door. Of course, there's me trying to grind money again. I was able to get some, but not enough. And by not enough, well, you'll see. All that money. I only get one pig out of that. What the crud? No. Go out of my way. getting all the money, but as soon as I go for those, I end up going to the boss battle. Oh. If you saw, you can actually use Ramon's hammer without you being Ramona. And fourth boss, Braxan. Half ninja, and fourth evil ex-boyfriend. Ramona had a sexy phase, and it meant nothing to her. But luckily I lucked out, and of course I had to grab an item. Hey! Oh! Oh! You're not shadow cloning this time! And there's little Gideon the cat. Yes, she named her cat Gideon. Gideon. And no, not after Gideon Graves. And on this Sonic Advance reference, I will see you guys in the next part. This is Max Pack 294 signing off for now.